let's have a look at how to notch and fold a standing seam roofing panel. We'll be using a couple of pairs of metal snips, along with a Malco drip edge folding tool, and finishing up with a Malco seamer and tongs tool, also known as a crimping tool. Here's Daniel making some measurements on a standing seam panel in order to cut and fasten it to a drip edge. Now, Daniel is a pro, but you can try this at home. The first thing Daniel does is cut the notches, snipping or folding the excess. You want to keep the notches and edges as clean as possible, so be sure to use a good pair of metal snips. If you need a pair, we've got you covered there too, just stop by the shop. After cutting the notches, he'll use a Malco drip edge folding tool to make the bend. With a little help from Craig, we're going to simulate a drip edge on the back of this truck. The goal here is to fasten the standing seam panel to the drip edge, keeping the panel from coming up, catching air, or any elements in the air. Once folded, grab your crimp tool and finish the fold cleanly. Here we see Daniel demonstrating how you can cut a panel at an angle as well, for when you have to set a panel in a valley or any other part of a roof. Standing Seam truly is the roof of the future. Stop by the showroom today for a demonstration. 